Wanna go to a place for some very nice treats? Shonda's Edible Delight has all the sweets. Hey, I'm Shonda with Shonda's Edible Delights. And I want to say thank you guys for joining me. So like I said, we're going to do green apple candy. This is four cups of sugar. Basic corn treat. That's two cups. One bottle of water. And it calls for four ounces of oil. Oh, I don't always measure, so I'm just going to pour it. Just a little of this in there, four ounces. And then I'm just gonna close it up, put the lid on, and start the machine. The machine is warming up. When it starts steaming, you take the lid off and I'll put the apple flavoring in it. This bucket came with my machine. It's a five gallon popcorn bucket. I don't, normally when I make my candies, I use plain white popcorn. No, no butter, no salt. But sometimes the butter will alter the color of your color. So I only use butter popcorn for my caramels. And even for my, my um, savories, I use plain because a lot of your, um, your flavor, your, your powders and stuff have a lot of salt in it. So if you use a salted popcorn and then you use a salt, a flavor that has a lot of salt, your popcorn is going to be too salty. This here is steaming. So I just take it up the lid off. You got to remember that's hot too. I use a third cup of that apple flavoring and I wait till the machine stops spinning so that I can dump it over in there, turn all the um, sugar and everything inside. Great. Let me see if I can show you guys inside. See now, you see the um, sugar is turning green. And when it gets to a certain temperature, the machine will buzz. <laughs> So I'm going to turn that off, I'm going to tilt this machine, and I'm going to pour this in. I just let it turn, and you see every, all the popcorn is getting coated. Sometimes I may flip it like this sometimes to help turn it and get it coated. Okay, so now this is the popcorn. It has a, it's covered up nicely, green for apple. And what I'll do here. Turn it and flip it until it cools off. When it comes out, it's not hard, it's not crunchy, it's still soft. You know? But once it dries, it'll be crunchy. It's coated itself. Right. And all I do with this tray, I pour it in the tray. Constantly mix, mix it because if you don't, it'll be in a clump. And you don't want that. You just want to make sure they stay apart because popcorn is prettier when it's not broken up. You see all the white pieces. Let me see. I don't know if you can see that good. Great. Yeah. When it's coated with the, the color, I think it's more prettier. And I thank you guys for joining me. I appreciate you guys. And I will send you a link, link in your email for the discount class for the um, Gourmet Academy if you'd like to okay. join. Thank you.
Thank you, guys. I appreciate everyone joining me tonight. Want to go to a place for some very nice treats, shunned of edible delights, has all the sweets, popcorn cakes and